hanging from the passenger side. Oh, good God! Hey, 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 buddy. You're not hanging out from the passenger side at all. Yeah, follow the dog. Follow the dog. Alrighty, come on, take one for the team. Doggy. Hey, everybody, welcome back. Falcon, the Flame and the Flood, episode number five, if I'm correct here. I do believe we have taken care of our slow issue that we started experiencing towards the end of the last episode. I haven't really had too much luck recording this the last two episodes now. The third one, we all know how that ended. It ended in my run because of the memory leak issue they were having. And then the end of the last episode basically turned into slow motionville. We weren't losing any frames. That was the odd thing about it. Like, our frames were still at 60, but apparently this game decided to just turn into, like, a very cinematic... Dramatic as well, slow motion type of capture into Falcon curing the illnesses that were actually afflicting us. But at least now it's running fine. I restarted the game and I reloaded and thankfully again my save is here. I'm thirsty though, which is going to be a problem. Hopefully we'll get some water pretty soon. Is it just me though or are the icons no longer appearing on my map? Because I only docked here because I noticed the, you know, the dock. But the icon wasn't really showing up on my map either. I'm not sure what's happening here. I'm worried about what's happening to the save now. Okay. Again. The the game is, again, 0 0.00.001. So it's definitely the infancy right now. So right now we're playing with, a, you know, just an experimental build over here. We have some... I'm not sure what that's happening in the screen right there. Yeah. Light jacket, though. That's pretty good. Inventory's full. That's great. Um, so we're thirsty, though. So let's go ahead and get some water happening first. That's going to bring us up to 86. We definitely need a lot of food. I think it's about time we eat this jerky. I said, eat the jerky. Nod. Oh. Well, let me put the slide jacket on. Cold protection four. Don't we have one of these already on, though? Oh, mine. The one that we had was only plus one, though. Perfect. Move this over to the raft here for now. Move this to my bag. Let's go ahead and consume this. And then we have moldy lump here too. We could probably just move this over to the raft because there's a spot for it there. And that's about it. Aloke, you could also go to the raft. We'll hold on to that alcohol, garlic. Alrighty. So let's see. Go ahead and collect some stuff here. Cotton pants and old lumber. Sure, I'll grab this and grab the suspicious water as well. I guess there's no point in not clearing that water up now. So old lumber. Move this over to the raft here for now. And let's make ourselves a tinder. Get this fire happening, and we'll clear up this water as well. This area does seem to be kind of uh, relatively safe from wolves, so that's the plus side here. It gives me some time to actually plot out my destination and get some items here underway. So, tools, don't need that. Consumable, clean water. Alrighty, anything else? Materials, braided core? Nope. Dandelion tea, tinder, and okay. So, for the most part, cotton pants are plus two protection. What are ones we're wearing? Let's unequip the ones that we're wearing, because I'm not sure how much is that one in terms of cold protection here. A uh, plus one, so we'll definitely equip the ones that we found. And we'll just move over the ones that we had to the raft here as well. I, I would like to imagine that if we could get the stone knife, you probably should be able to break down this old clothing into rags. I mean, just about every other survival game basically works that way. Yuka's pretty good, that's plus ten food. As a matter of fact, let's um get our fill of it right now. We could probably do one more. Great. Alright, so that's underway now. Oh, hey, let's get that one. <laughs> Thank you, my doggy friend. We'll also probably sleep an hour before we decide to book it from this area, but before we do get some sleep, let's make sure that we have explored the rest of this area. To my knowledge, it was relatively free of wolves, but obviously Falcon has a tendency to miss stuff that's relatively easy sometimes. But it does seem that we're cleared out over here and nothing else to actually really pillage. Alrighty. Let's go and get some sleep. Where are you going, doggy? Oh. Uh, cattails. I have enough of those. I'll pick one more up just for the hell of it. To cap our five, but that's about it. And let's go ahead and just get an hour of sleep here. That's all we really do need right now. Clear up our fatigue, and then we could hit the road again. And what I'm worried about is I hope that the icons start showing up on my map again. <laughs> Otherwise, I'm not sure how. I'm going to actually plot for destinations. I guess in a way I could kind of see it as hard mode survival, you know? I don't really see the icons on the map, so it's just basically I have to really figure out where I could dock and what path I could actually take here. But let's see if it's cleared up. At least the slow motion's gone. Let's see here. Alrighty. No icons on the map. That's not necessarily a bad thing, you know. It happens sometimes when there's no locations around. 
Yeah, see that's right there. No, no, no icon on this one. And that's the place you could actually dock into. I'm not sure what's happening, but we're having the worst luck with this uh, recording here today. The first two episodes went fine. After the third one, though. Cattail. We can make a fire here, but before we decide to stay here a while, let's make sure there's no crazy wolf men around. Both the one on four feet and the ones that are actual, just actual, literally wolf men. Oh, what is that over there? That's a crow, maybe. It's moving a bit too erratic to be a wolf. Empty car, of course. How you doing, rabbits? Another car for us to check out. Sapling, and there's Dandelion up there too, I want to say. Come on, car, have something good for me. Assorted hardware. Well, I mean, it's got to be used for at some point. Sumac. Dandelion. Dandelion. And Sapling, which we already maxed out on. Eh. Well, this was kind of a disappointing area to really search. Well, I guess we got the Sumac, which is something you don't really see too often, so I guess that's fine. But can we make anything out of that? Well, not yet. The journal would have popped up letting me know there's something new to make. Alrighty. Next town over or next island over. The only problem, again, as they mentioned, no idea where the next town's gonna be, or town. Falcon are not fucking towns, they're literally just husk of land with any sort of, um... There's no civilization on it, there's no towns whatsoever left over. There's an item we could kind of pillage here, though. Grubs, yes, 20 food. Alcohol, sweet. That's gonna be for bandages as well. Oh, okay. Alright, Falcon, keep an eye out. There's obviously no more icons in my map anymore. Oh, there they're they're back now. I have no idea what's happening with this game. It's got its mind of its own, you know? It makes the rules as it goes along. Alright, so let's just have a little bit of a hangout here at the old town island. And there's another island coming up to the right-hand side as well. Make a fire here. I'll consider it. So we get safe. Oh, corn! Yeah. If we get two corn again, we can make the ash cake, which isn't too bad. I mean, it's not amazing, but it's something. Let's move you over to the raft. And... Move you over to the raft here. Meanwhile, pick up corn. There's a fire here. And a house. Empty house. Crates. Crates, yes. Rags and flint. Oh, really good. Okay. That's really, really good. Let's move you. As a matter of fact, let's have the grubs now. We could definitely just max our hunger out. And we might as well have some water, too. I'm going to hold on to the rags, though. Stone knife. We can make the stone knife, allegedly. Or at least we know how to make it now. What? What, what is it? What is it, buddy? What's in there? Yeah, I don't... Oh! Oh! That's what was in there. Oh, uh, we gotta go. We just gotta go. I'm sorry, dog. You're on your own. <laughs> oh, you teleport now. Hey, good for you. Oh, how was that? Was he inside the house the entire time? I'm not sure what just happened there, but it was the most terrifying thing of all time. I thought literally, like, you know, that, that wolf head just ate my grandma. It was like Little Red Riding Hood in a sense. Uh, let's dock over here. Perfect. Alrighty. Let's take a look at the stone knife here. There's normally no wolves in the fish houses, because it's a small area. But, you know, for all I know, with my luck, we'll have some now. Let's hang out here for a second, though. Everything seems fine. Splices. Uh, search. Grubs and nightcrawlers. Ooh, that's a lot of good food. I mean, not literally food, but you know what I mean. It's the best we can do. Move to the raft, and, um... Momentarily, let's actually move you to the raft as well. So I want to pick both of those bad boys up. And let's see, Aesop, you carry the food for now. How about that? Move to... Nope. Move over to Aesop. He's going to carry the food for us meanwhile. I think that works out really totally good. Good system here. Okay, let's take a look at this stone knife here, potentially. Tools. Stone knife. We can make it. Flint, rags, and sapling. Yes. Make it now. All right, guys. We have the stone knife, finally. And I've never had this before, so I'm excited about it. What is it for? Where has it gone? Is my other question. Are, are you kidding me right now? I've made it, right? Where is it? Oh, game. Don't, don't mess with me this way. 
Excuse me? I make the stone knife and it suddenly disappears? Am I just not seeing it? There's no stone knife here. Is it a weapon? I don't see it as a weapon. I'm not swinging a weapon. You're healthy. I didn't really want to make the tinder. That was a mistake, but... Oh, come on. Come the fuck on. <laughs> what happened to my stone knife? Well, maybe it's not implemented yet. I don't know. I have no idea what to tell you. I'm just as confused, believe me. Uh, I'll grab this yucca, wild garlic, dandelion, aloe. Alrighty. Well, I'm disappointed about that endeavor. Move to the raft. And yucca. I could have you now. Yeah, might as well have you now. Consume that. We'll hold on to the tinder and let's see water. We have two more left over. Alrighty, let's continue going forward, even though I'm relatively disappointed about what happened with our potential for the stone knife there. So if I can't make the stone knife yet, then I can't make the traps, right? Is that what you're telling me? Because I made the stone knife. It's not going to suddenly disappear. I don't know. Confused. I'll probably have to hit up the developers and see what's going on. Or maybe check out the forums or something. Maybe there's an update on it. But for now, I can't really tell. But we'll continue going forward. I'm not going to give up on the run just yet because of that. I enjoy the game too much just for that. But if there is some stuff waiting to be implemented, we might just probably make this a last run for now. And um, wait till some of the more advanced uh, implementations come in here. I'm really excited for the updates too. So there is that. Make it sleep here. And as a matter of fact, we probably should sleep here kind of soon. Another Devil's Trumpet. Our fatigue meter is getting kind of high up there anyway. Mulberries, yes. Good food. And you can stack them up to ten. Huh, this is a really... Inv investigate the swing. It's a wonder this hasn't crumbled to dust. It's been a long time since the swing brought joy to anyone. Never uh, gotten that little thing before. Spoiled meat? You know, grab it for now, but it's kind of useless, really. Moldy lump? Garlic? Alrighty, we gotta make some inventory management here. We gotta clear that up. So you move over to the raft for one. Devil Trumpet? I have two Devil Trumpets. They don't make anything new, so let's move into the raft for now as well. There you go. And I'm going to probably use this tinder to make a fire pretty soon. Moldy lump, I'm pretty sure we have a stock of it in the raft, so we'll move you over there. And garlic is being carried by our doggy. Alrighty, there's a house here too. Search the farmhouse. Gonna take a while, but luckily there is no wolf, so there's absolutely no rush apparently. Spoiled meat. Oh, great. <laughs> that was worth my time. Let's see here. Assorted hardware. That is the second piece of assorted hardware we're getting. Anything I can make with that? Materials? Nope. Tools? Nope. Alrighty. So, move over to the raft here for now. Now we're gonna make a fire and get this over here completely cleared up. Shut your mouth, alright? Don't be alerting wolves to my location, my friend. What are you guys in cahoots or something? You guys working together? Screw me over? There was a school bus over here to sleep. Let's start this fire, clear up the water, and get some sleep, and then we book it out of here. I think that's a really ideal plan. If I do say so myself, I'm gonna have some coffee here meanwhile. Oh, it's really cold. <laughs> Materials, remedies, dandelion tea. Oh, penicillin. Moldy lump for the penicillin. Good to know. Good to know. Stone knife? Yeah, you can go fuck yourself. Thanks a lot for using up the items that I limitedly had. For that stone knife that went nowhere. At all. Alright, let's leave. Uh, I think it's about time to probably get some of this water as well. But first, let's have an hour of sleep. Maybe two is going to clear it up. I wonder if your hunger and thirst go up when you sleep. Or go down, anyway. Doesn't seem like it, right? Seems like it's still at the same level. But now we got to go. Nighttime worries me significantly. Let's have some water here really quickly. That's alcohol. Okay, we're not looking to get drunk right now. I don't think it's a good idea to go down that crazy water rafting ride while you're intoxicated. Seems like a really bad idea. I wonder if the screen blurs up on you or something. That'd be a pretty good effect. 
Okay. There's a church over there, but I don't think we're going to be able to make it over to the left. Since we're going downstream. I remember when, um... I saw the drunk effect in... What was it? Was it Grand Theft Auto 3 or Vice City? Or was it San Andreas? I'm not really sure which one it was, but... Oh, look. Rags. Oh, nice. I remember seeing that, um... The little effect for it with the screen being all wobbly. And I thought it was the coolest thing, you know, growing up. I was like, oh, man, it's so awesome. You could get drunk. And then the effect and the charm for it really wore off really quickly. I was kind of like, oh, yeah, that's um, oddly very annoying. And there's no benefit for it whatsoever. <laughs> but I remember the first time I saw it, though, I thought the addition of it was kind of cool. But then you quickly realize, oh, it's just kind of really pointless. It doesn't really do much. It's like, oh, yeah, it's wobbly. The screen's all weird. Uh, wasn't there, like, an event with San Andreas that we could actually get, like, wouldn't you get, like, high because you were moving somebody? Or, yeah, you were doing the weed event where you had to burn it down, if I'm right. I don't even know why I'm talking about San Andreas here suddenly. I guess the alcohol thing in the inventory kind of led me astray with that empty. Swell. No wolves here, right? Better not be any stinking wolves. There's also a stone axe, if I remember correctly. On one of my off-camera runs, I did I, um, see that. It's an option. But again, if the stone knife disappeared, I could only imagine that the same would probably happen to the <laughs> stone axe. I guess the only thing left for us to really try to make then is maybe the torch. I did mention that I want to try something more experimental with this run. Ooh, corn. We could probably make ourselves that cake out of fire. Because we should have two corn now. Can't we make a torch though right now is my question. Um, let's see. Consumables, materials. We're looking for tools. Yeah, we could actually make it already. Let's, um, hold on to making it into we're near a wolf, or should we just try it out now? Let's just try it out now. Let's see if it works out or not. I want to see if it's kind of like something you could use over and over, too. So it's here. Let's read up on it. A bright flame will keep useful, will be useful to keep uh, predatory beings away. Okay. So whenever we run into a, a wolf again, we could probably see if it works out or not. Do we need to do anything at the fire area? Not pretty. Well, I guess we could probably make that ash cake now. Move over to the bag, craft a tender, and we'll make the ash cake. I might as well just consume it instantly, right? Get a little bit of our hunger under control here. Alright, that's good. And ba -ba 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 -ba, my Sharona, where are you at? Consumables we're looking for. Ash cake. There you go. So that's under control. Braided cord. Dandelion tea. Uh, not enough water to be experimental with that one. I wanted to try it last time around, but unfortunately, we are kind of low on water right now. Let's just go ahead go ahead and have the ash cake for 20. It's going to bring us up to 90. So we're looking all right in terms of food. Water, we could use a bit more. That is for sure. We'll probably head up one more island and probably wrap it up. And more than likely, hopefully, we will run into a wolf for once because I want to try out this torch. I, I'm definitely curious to see if it works out or not. Can we make it over here without crashing into one of these islands? It does seem we can. There's a tent area over here that I can't make it to, I don't think. Nope. Way too often. To, uh, way too to the right. Alrighty. Can I come down this way, though? Okay, good. We're in day four. I mean... Obviously, I think our first run was a, well, was a lot better than this one, but, you know, we're still making some progress again. So, I don't know, maybe we'll even do better this time around. Alright. Not much happening over here. Hunger is looking fine. We could probably get some sleep kind of soon. There's a the fish house coming up, which is actually pretty good. Hopefully, we can find a few more night crawlers and grubs for easy food. Oh, I got some grubs from that loot. I thought I completely missed it, but no. I was able to get it. Lover's Point. Point A. Alright. Let's see here. Normally, no nasty critters around here. Got some more sumac, though. Sapling. Are we stocked in sapling? We could use one more. I'll grab that one. Please let there be some nightcrawlers. Yes. Good. Very good. And let's see here. We're at 79. We might as well just have... Nightcrawlers. Consume that one. It's going to go up to 99. I think it's about time we could have some water, too. We're kind of close to 60, anyway. And this here could be moved over to ASAP now. Both of you, as a matter of fact. Okay, that's good. We have two sumacs. 
And that's about it. Cattail, we're at. I think we could definitely use a bit more cattail because we made a few tenders down the line. And that's about it. We saved when we got into this island, right? Because I am looking to wrap it up here for today. I think we saved. Let me get out of here. I think that should be a save here. Right? Yeah, we're saving. Alright, you guys, we're going to wrap it up here unless... Unless... Wait a minute. Oh, I'm so close. I docked. <laughs> Alrighty. We'll probably go a bit longer. I really want to try out this torch and the wolf, though. That's the thing. I don't want to rob you guys of that. Yeah, those wolves aren't around when I actually have a weapon for them, too. Scum lords. Eh. No wolves. Of course they wouldn't be here. Terrified of me right now. I don't blame it. Ooh, corn and flint. Nice. Maybe we can make ourselves another stone knife, guys. <laughs> yeah. I'm being facetious, of course. I'm still upset about that. Old lumber. Uh, corn. Let's just move you over to Aesop and pick this old lumber up. We have quite a bit of old lumber, right? Yeah. Move this over to the raft, though. Remember, this dog starts barking at the house. It means there's probably a wolf in there like last time. Yep. Enjoy that. No one? Exactly. Broken seesaw, dandelions that you don't need. Yeah. Unfortunately for us, no. Wolfman. I'll take the yucca, though, because that's 10 food. Yeah, no wolfman, though. That's really unfortunate. I don't need that dandelion. Doggy. Doggy friend. So I guess we'll probably make a fire here and wrap it up. So hopefully you guys enjoyed it. Leave a thumbs up. Leave a like to support. That's me a lot. We'll stick in uh, next episode and hopefully find a wolf finally to try out this torch with. I will catch you next time.